All right, so let's go, Lacey. We'll get <laughs> title. Just say liquor whiskey bottle collection. Seven to include. Ready? 12.25 inch height. Monsieur Henron Royal Port California wine with unbroken seal. Bottle two, original paper label, Williams and Humpert. The Jamaican liqueur. Echo Imeiko. It is 10.25 inches in height. It appears to be complete and all original. Overall condition is very good. Done. Next. This is Melrose. Look closely for the viewers on, on the video here. The top uh, seal on these are unmarked. Notice the unmarked seal at the top and then notice this one. A little different. 11.25 inches in height. All appear to be complete and all original. Early 20th century. 11.5 inches in height with original good health bottom is also marked made in Czechoslovakia but don't ask me how to spell it what number 65 this is gonna be cool for the video mid 20th century three inches in height six inch diameter platform marked sales maker model five this display is in excellent original working condition you don't have it Mountain Dew bottle going around on that thing, don't you? Electric with lightning bolts. Lightning bolts. 10 ounce electric bottling co. Wilmington NC. The ruler's on it. 8.75 inches in height. Overall condition is excellent original. Mid 20th century, 59 inches in height, 14 inches wide, five inches in depth. Industrial design, wire construction with 80 bottle compartment. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. Overall condition is good with some surface rust being sold with 12 bottles. Mid 20th century, 15, is everything okay back there? Yeah. 8.5 inches in height, appears to be complete and all original, overall excellent. Thank you, next. To include, two, 8.75 inches in height, embossed Melville, Burlington. You have a 4.5 inch height, half pint, ACL, enjoy Melville milk. It is a double dot embossed six pack carrier displaying five bottles. Overall condition is very good. Thank you. 20th century, appears to be complete and original with six bottles. Overall condition is excellent. Done. Here we have two ACL bottles, Pepsi Cola. One is a double dot and one is a single dot. Look carefully and you'll see the difference. In between Pepsi and Cola, two dots, single dot. This happened in 1951. So it's a good dating instrument to know when the bottle was made. You can say as early as 1951 or pre-1951 for the double dot. Enjoy Coca-Cola while you shop. All right, this is what you would connect to your cart and then you, while you were shopping, you put a Coca-Cola bottle in there. John, this is a better bottle. Mm -hmm. Wait you hear what I'll say it is. You need to look at it. Ready? Winchester VA. Hobble skirt bottles. Hobble skirt bottles. NOS translates to new old stock. An old fashioned wall mounted bottle opener. Artwork of Coca-Cola bottle and wings. Complete with six unopened bottles. New Mexico. Here's a good one from where Buddy Holly's from, Lubbock, Texas. Overall condition is outstanding and original. Thank you. Lot number 79, mid 20th century, 12 inches in height, one gallon, seven up bottling company of Durham NC. Overall condition is excellent original, done. Y'all ain't gonna believe what some of these scans were. I looked them up. Copia de can. <laughs> <laughs> and it means copy of can? Yeah. All right, thank you, Jose. Overall condition appears to be complete and all original. They're gonna bring $5. It's gonna bring $100. John, that, that cherry can was like $30 online. I looked it up. I couldn't find that one. I got it.
Give me lots we gotta tie. Mm -hmm. Thousands. Okay, thank you again for coming down on day one of the briefing of the annual Carolina Country Store sale. I think we've done a great job on the models. We got a lot of information for the beginning collectors as well as the advanced collectors. The video of the Mountain Dew bottle is great. There's a lot of collectors out there that would love to be aware of where that bottle's at and it's actually being sold at no reserves here at Mebbin Auction. Uh, check back for updates going into the apothecary bottles, medicine, and the store jars right after the soda pop bottle session. And then on Friday morning, the day two of the country store sale will be the featured Tobacchiana collection with incredible rare discoveries.